Netflix app is available on App Store only for iPhones, iPads and Apple TV and there is no way to install it on macOS. So in this video I will show you thoroughly how to install Netflix app on macOS based Apple Silicon chip. But if you have Mac based Intel CPU then I recommend you to watch my previous video on how to install Netflix. You will find the link up here or in the description. The tutorial that I'm showing you today is pretty simple but every part is very important so I recommend you to watch it until the end and don't skip any part. Okay, without further ado, let's start. Firstly, download the installation files from the link in the description of the video. After you download the files from the link, double click on Site Loadly Setup and then drag the Site Loadly to Applications. Now open Applications and click on Site Loadly app. You will receive a message that the app cannot be opened because the developer cannot be verified. Don't worry, that is completely fine. Open System Preferences and then click Security and Privacy. And then click Cancel on the pop-up message. Now click Open anyway and then click Open. Now Side Loadly is ready to use. The first time you use Side Loadly, you need to enter your Apple ID and password. Enter the Apple account and now drag the Netflix file into the Side Loadly window and then click Start. Enter the password of the Apple account and then click OK. And the installation process is starting. When it's done, go back to the application and find Netflix. Now you can drag it into the menu bar or wherever you want and then open it. At the first time you will get the following message. Open security and privacy and click OK on the pop-up message and then click open anyway. I recommend you to select always trust apps from this developer and then click open. And now Netflix ready to use. Sign in with your Netflix account. Now you can watch content and even download the content exactly like in the original Netflix app. Now that the Netflix app works perfectly fine, press right click on Site Loadly Setup and then click Eject. Unfortunately, after a 7 days of use Netflix, you probably will get the following message. So you will need to repeat the following steps every 7 days. Click OK on the pop-up message. Now you need to delete Netflix from the dock and from applications. Open the SideLoadly app and then drag the Netflix file into the SideLoadly window and then click Start. After the installation process is done, go to Applications and find Netflix. Drag the icon to the dock and open it. You will get the following message. Open System Preferences and choose Security and Privacy. Now click OK on the pop-up message and then click Open anyway. Select Always Trust Apps from this developer and then click Open. And the Netflix app is ready to use for another 7 days. If you prefer a solution without repeatedly installing Netflix every week, then I recommend you to watch the next video. 